Hey everyone, I'm Keisha Charmaine and I'm back here to show you all how I achieved this amazing bun really simply, really quickly using a hairnet. Now I hope you saw my 10 hair hacks video if you haven't checked that out but in that video I mentioned that hairnets are a must have for lock styles, for maintaining your curls and for achieving a bun. So if you want to see how I achieved this bun keep watching. But first, I want to show you these cool pins that I'm rocking by Radical Dreams Pins. This gold one says dope. Black Girl Magic, of course I got a ton of that. Michelle and Barack, I just love these. <laughs> Purpose and a Black Panther pin. On this side I have Still I Rise, as you know, that's a poem from Maya Angelou. Here I have a Black Fist you know that represents black power. This black heart says black girls. So you know I love black girls. That's kind of what it symbolizes of course. And here is Angela Davis, civil rights activist. I have a bunch more but I didn't want to overdo it on my shirt. But I think it's really cool when you wear a bunch at one time. But of course you don't have to do that. You can just wear one. Like I would just wear this dope one like on a regular basis and I think it's cute. Or still I rise. But you know of course you can Pin them to your bags, your jackets. I also have some patches. So these are only some of the pins that Radical Dreams has in store. So definitely check out the website to see more and see what suits your interests and your style. Now let's get into this bun. Okay, first things first. You want to grab your locks and put it into a ponytail. However high you sit the ponytail is how high your bun is going to be. Then you want to finger comb your locks so that the locks go into the ponytail smoothly and neatly. Once your ponytail is as secure and as tight as you want it, we can start with the bun. So now you want to fan out your locks in a circle so that the locks are going all around the base of the bun. And now we're going to work in sections. You want to grab one section and wrap it and tuck it underneath the next set of locks. And you want to keep doing that all around. Just tuck and wrap under, tuck and wrap under, tuck and wrap under. And you want to twist it to help keep it firm and just keep twisting and tucking and twisting and tucking and there you have it. That's the simplest way I know how to make a bun and the quickest way. This took under a minute. But it's not all that secure, you know, there's no pins here, I'm not using a second ponytail holder, so you want to grab your hairnet, which will be invisible, don't worry, no one's going to be able to see that it's there. Grab your hairnet and you want to make sure that it's tight and secure so that the bun stays in place all day long, so you pull the excess net and wrap it around and tuck it in. And there you have it, that's it, it's simple, so simple and so pretty, okay? It's not going to move. It's not going to budge. I wore my hair like this for about 24 hours. I slept in it. And look, shake, shake, shake. It's not moving anywhere. Oh, you good? You good? Your head hurts? You all right? Get it together. All right. So try this bun out. Let me know how it works for you. Oh, wait. <laughs> First, I want to make sure that my edges are nice and laid. So I grab a stocking leg. That's one of my hair hacks. Definitely check out my hair hacks video if you haven't seen it already. It's pretty new. And I just put that on for 10 minutes. And when I take it out, my frizzy edges are smoothened. And then I like to brush out my baby hairs a little bit. It makes your forehead look smaller, you know. And that's it. My bun is complete. Thanks for watching. Love, light, and locks.